All right, fight fans, here we go. This next fighter fighting out of the blue corner. Here's a freestyle fighter with a record of 0-3. Standing 5 foot 11, weighing 165 pounds. He fights for Team Body Bag, and he's sponsored by Death Punch Fightwear. Ladies and gentlemen from Indianapolis, Indiana, give it up for Brandon Hicks. And his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, here's a kickboxer with a record of one and one, standing six foot tall, weighing 170 pounds. He's sponsored by Triskull Fightwear and Debo Fades. Ladies and gentlemen, from the west side of Indianapolis, here comes TKO Tim Kaler. And here we go with Tim Kohler versus Brandon Hicks. Brandon Hicks in the blue corner, Kohler in the red. Uh, both of these guys are winless. Kohler at 0-2, Hicks at 0-3, so uh, someone zero has got to go. I didn't make that up, someone else did. I heard someone say that. Yeah, but typically that's uh, the other way around. You know, when somebody's undefeated, that, that O has got to go. Well, that O's got to go here tonight, too. <laughs> somebody's is. Somebody's O has got to go. <laughs> Unless we end up with a draw, and that does happen every that's now. That's right. This, uh, this fight actually put together at the last minute. Uh, Kohler slated to fight Roderick Cole. Uh, nice head kick by Kohler. Roderick Cole uh, comes in way overweight, misses weight, very unprofessional, and uh, just walks out of weigh-ins, and Kohler's left without an opponent. So uh, Hicks stepped up, and uh, these guys agreed to fight each other. It looks like that head kick uh, actually upset, um, what's his name, Hicks again? Yeah, Hicks. And, uh, you know, he came out and real strong, landed quite a few uh, good shots to the head of Kohler. Nice Superman punch, turns oh. Kohler around. He lands a few of them, uppercuts. Flurry up Looks like he there. might finish it right here. He's landing. Oh, take down. Oh. Oh. Looks like he's, here and he's going for that guillotine. I don't know why he stopped throwing those punches. Yeah, he was landing those punches yeah, left I, and right. He was well on his way to finishing that fight, but he could right here too. It almost looked like a tap by Kohler there. Looks like he's got it sunk in pretty deep. Kohler trying to Yeah, he needs to jump, pull guard. Oh. Yep. Nope, goes to the ground. Oh, wow. Kohler lands a couple good shots. Gave now, him too now, much room. Hicks is on top. Now Kohler trying to sink in the choke. These guys, uh, again, had no idea they were going to fight each other. Uh, thanks to Roderick Cole not making weight. They ended up in the cage together. So big shout out to Roderick Cole for missing weight. Very professional. <laughs> not sure why Hicks isn't throwing some knees to the body here. You know, he's, uh, he's in a guillotine, but uh, you know, it doesn't really look like he's doing too much damage. This is the, uh, this is an advanced amateur bout as well. So uh, the uh, novice rule is not applying here. Not sure what Kohler's doing there. Hicks needs to pop that head out. With him uh, being on that side, it's going to be impossible for Kohler to choke him there. He's he actually needs to get that right arm underneath the head goes. of Kohler. And, and he pops out. Force that Von Flu, which is one of my favorite uh, submissions. Man, he's landing a flurry of punches to Kohler. And a break in the action there. What? Not sure what's going on here. An apology, a timeout. Maybe it's a mouthpiece. And they're back at it. Extreme sportsmanship by uh, by Hicks there. Yeah, landing, landing lots of punches there on the ground. Kohler definitely coming up short on that. See what happens here in round two. It looks like uh, Hicks has definitely uh, found his groove, getting the best of Kohler. Um, I don't think Hicks minds whether they're standing up or on the ground. It looks like he's pretty confident. Round two, ring girl, uh, Ashley in there. Looks like Kohler and uh, Hicks getting some corner advice here and uh, 
That's George good. Odell over in uh, Kohler's corner. He's a 135 professional fighter. Looks like the ref was coming over to check once again, make sure Kohler's all right. Kohler looks pretty winded, so uh, the second round may not go the distance. We'll see. All right, ladies Brandon and Hicks gentlemen, here we fresh. go with round number looks two. Looks like he's ready to go. Round two is brought to you by we'll start round Scott two here. McCorkle and Big Dog Once again, Limousine. thanks to NDR20.com and Community Ford for their sponsorship of LFC 52. Here we go with round number two. Looks like Kohler is uh, a little timid here, starting the action. Yeah, a little hesitant. Hicks pushing it again, again landing some punches there. Kohler is just kind of wild, wildly swinging there with punches and kicks. They go to the ground. He's trying to take Hicks's back here, it looks like. It's pretty high up on him. He needs to stay tight, get those hooks in, flatten him out, you know, prevent from being bucked oh, like that. Yep. Good call, Shane. Uh oh, another He's flurry. just going to work now. Hicks is devastating on top there with his ground and pound. This is going to end here. Yep, that's it. Kohler uh, stays winless and Hicks gets his first win. Ladies and gentlemen, we go to the official time and decision, which is brought to you by Community Ford. 46 seconds in round number two. Your winner by verbal submission. Out of the blue corner, Brandon Hicks. 